Welcome to Einhaven. For year 55 of this playthrough. Let's get it rolling. Uh, right, so... I think this year, th this is um, tidying up an aesthetics I'm still doing, been doing for a while. Make it look prettier. Um, Going to carry on with this area with the intention of adding more housing. Um, probably can I extend it out I think don't know how far out and what I'm going to do with it but um, we'll get this flank tidied up and pop a wall down and stuff like that and then I'll see how it looks and think about like wait for that to finish what it would look like if it was extended out this way But that's in a couple of years' time, that's in the future. Because for the minute, I think this is going to have to be a push for 500 villagers, really. So we've got two houses going down there. So that will give us room for 480. Where are the other spaces? Hmm... Possibly one there? No, no. Yeah, no, one there. That'll be alright. Might as well get that in position now. After all that, <laughs> after all that messing around with um, people dying on me. Um, oh no, I can't put it there. Not enough room. That's a bugger. Um, <laughs> I find I'm kind of pausing and thinking, oh, should I do that? But I've done all the pavements. Certainly all the pavements in respect of um, putting houses in and that. So I don't need to worry about it anymore. Right, I do need to make room. Oh, that, was, that surprises me. Didn't think I'd have to make room for more housing, but apparently so. Just get this going. Uh, I'll set a priority on that so everyone who's free can help carry the resources. And my castle barn is done. I'll get the caravan stables rolling on that. Oh, hello. Who's hungry? I got a hungry bod. Where? Where are you, hungry person? Where? I'm not seeing you. There shouldn't be. Oh, there he is. Okay, what have you been doing then? Nothing. What are you doing out there, you fool? Just go and eat. What's the matter with you, man? Better. We don't need any hungry people. We don't have homeless problems now. And if we did, I have a workaround. <laughs> I've got a workaround. Did I mention that? Uh, <laughs> right. So yeah, I need to need to get this finished. Need to organise space for more houses, and see how much of that I can get on the go ready for the growing season. Growing season, I'll do some more potatoes. I'm gonna sort this field out down there as well. Uh, flat. Okay. Wheat's okay. I'm not managing to, um, with all these bloody windmills, I'm not managing to create enough flour to, <laughs> to to keep the bakeries busy, incredibly. I've had to do, you know, resource trading and get flour that way from here. What's fish doing in there? Oh, that's the barn. Silly ones. Yeah. And I guess I will have to continue in that vein as well. Uh, yeah, so uh, I'll do a few fields of flax, I think that was. A few fields of potatoes, one field of wheat is probably not. Grain, rather, is probably not needed. Um, no, nah, don't think it is.
do an extra field of potatoes in its place. So yeah, that's all the veg and the flax sorted out. I'm going to demolish this field, I think, and reposition it. Although, actually, no, I, might, I don't need to do it now. Um, once I've got all this sorted out, I'll relay the field and demolish it and relay it. Um, but I do want this area free for houses. Mm, Big glitchy. Good, you can go there. Okay, so I think that's a vague working plan for the year. See how we get on. And I shall leave you with that view. Let the game run and see if we can't have a bit of a charge towards 500 villagers. Excellent. We have raiders on the horizon. Looks like they're coming straight at us. Same position again, so when I get a bit closer I'll be back. Here they come. No rush. Same place. Whether you would imagine the same result. Let's see where they land, inside or outside this time. Oh, outside. Oh, that worked. Okay. There's one outside. Sorry, I'm just curious. One inside, two inside. Three inside. Four raiders. Five inside. Oh, quite a lot of them. It's getting stroppier, but they're still not coming in. Wow. Excitement. We have... Go on, have a guess. You'll never guess. It's a building fire. Spring has sprung. The grass has riz. I wonder where all the fires is. Uh, I'm also having a bit of a rethink in terms of schools. Because um, I think I've got it a bit wrong. Uh, if I can find the damn thing. Oh, this rain. Uh, nope, not far along, not far along. There we go. So I popped the two schools there, thinking they, they didn't quite cover the whole of the settlement because I started spreading. So I bunged another school down here, which takes care of the bottom bit. But it doesn't quite reach the top bit, <laughs> so I'm popping one there where the original one was. <coughs> Demolishing one of these two in the centre, I can pop a bakery in there, make use of that. And I'm going to put one down here, in this bottom corner, near the keep, to cover... That's one of my windmills. Um, to cover all this bank of new houses that again weren't there when I started, um, started the process off. All the buildings and adding to them. Um, got another bakery going in this sort of odd bit up in the corner that quite got room to put a house in. Loads of room around here. I wonder why I didn't put two there. That's a bit daft. Given that you can fit two there, I should have been able to fit two there. I guess not there either. Maybe you just couldn't get up close. Yeah, okay. Couldn't get close enough up that for this one to have two next to it. But I could there. And I think I shall. That needs to uh, be broken down. Oh, this used to be all different levels than that, didn't it, once upon a time? Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Right. In which case, we shall demolish this and fit another one in. Yeah, so, uh, as expected, loads of building going on. Good, that's good. There's my big level 3 watchtower. That gives the radius to cover this gap. 
So I can now terraform this pot pavements down and continue the wall along here, which is what I wanted all along. Outstanding. Got myself a little ant promenade or procession. Very orderly. Going clockwise, round and round and round. Oh, there's, there's always someone going against the tide. <laughs> yeah, this is me emptying this castle barn. And I've got so many people spare, I thought, yeah, let's try this, see how it works. And there it is. It just gives all the windows open. I've got so many bloody things on the go. I've uh, had to start keeping track of them visually. Huh. It's going down. I'm <laughs> really having a, having a good old go. That's not going to have enough room though, so they'll end up going down here, I guess, afterwards. Yeah. Busy little people. A little update on the building projects. Uh, so the fish farms, that original line have all been demolished. Um, I've got the entrances tidied up with, as you can see, a fabulous line of lampposts. Um, the pasture that was there, I've now got room for two. So I demolished, moved, I'm oh, sorry, I built that, moved the, the cattle into it. Um, demolished it. Dem sorry, demolished the old one because it was completely the wrong size. Built this in the right place so that I can position one next to it as well in the same way I've done with these. It's really weird that you can't just do this as one um, pasture or whatever, and it take the right amount of space up. I don't, I don't get it, but you know, one of those things. I'm sure there's a perfectly good explanation for it. Um, I just don't happen to know what it is. And I'm demolishing this pasture because now I didn't have the foresight, because I'm stupid, to put it a little bit further back so that I could just stick the new one in, in its place. Four. So, yeah. Um, now I'm demolishing that. When that's demolished, I can stick the second cow pasture next to this one in the same way I have with all the other animals. Um, I'm going to build... Build? Why did I demolish that? Don't know, kind of been important. So, um, I'm going to build another field here. Yeah, plus 17, that'll do it nicely. Got all of theirs. I've got a load of people spare deliberately because I'm um, using them to ferry the resources. Why would I have demolished that? You can probably tell I've slept since um, <laughs> when I last played this. In actual fact, I've had a few nights on the um, Peninsula campaign. The other, uh, yeah, the other. The campaign, if you like, I've been running the other. No, I'm not seeing what I want. Yeah, anyway, so my head's been um, in Napoleon's world for a little while. I'll get back into this now. Get my head back into this, anyway. So there's enough resources for the caravan stables that we're rebuilding, having pavemented it. That's being done. I think everything else there is done. All the pavements have been relaid. What was on top of them demolished, the pavements have been laid. And the new buildings at the right level, and the new buildings all put in their place. Dare I say, I think that's alright. I've got to sort the caravan stable trade routes out again. Because I've been demolishing things like storage barns and caravan stables in that case. Hmm. Have a quick look. So fruit pies have recovered. Vegetable pies are starting to fall off a bit. Uh, let's just switch two of these over to veg pies. 
see if that will help them recover a little bit. Uh, so yeah, we have a lot more bakeries now. Um, so 58, so there's going to be, what, 29 bakeries? Basically, that great big wodge there. And these odd ones tucked out here. And talking of which, one of the bakers has snuffed it. That's nice. Uh, so caravan stables in hand. The field is pretty much done. Those three pavements are being laid. We are going to need a scary dude standing on the end, aren't we? It would be rude not to. Come on guys, speed up a bit. I want to see where the layout is so I know where to... Yeah, that's going to be your last one, isn't it? So, any second now it will go... Poof! Poof! There we go. Let's turn him to face inwards, so he looks scarier. Right, so you cover that half, you cover that half, that's all done. Um, I guess also, so if we stick him in there, I guess also I'm going to need, I assume I need a stone road. Do I need, no, okay, there's already a stone road, cool. Excellent. So when that's gone, that will give me room for possibly more houses. Oh no, no, that's right. Yeah, okay. So we've leveled this area off. There's no pavements here. Um, to possibly put a field or two in here, just very local fields, just for oats and grass, so this entire corner can be self-sustained. That's the plan. And flax maybe as well for that. Ooh. I've just finished building there. Uh, oh, that was the temporary. Okay, God blimey, I was so out of touch with this guy. So that barn was put in temporarily to uh, enable us to empty the barns in this area out and stick new ones in. Uh, what's that level like? Do we want to raise that level? I think that looks quite nice like that. Yeah. No, I think I'll leave that level as it is. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Don't have to demolish something. Yay! <laughs> good grief. Uh, these old pavements and then... When that's done, uh, room for another ass. Stick ass in there. Right. Well, and the research is finished. It's agronomy. I've done this before, haven't I? Crops and trees. Yes, we'll do that. Why not? Why not? We'll keep you earning your pay. Pretty sure I said that phrase in the video I just recorded, actually, the Napoleon one. <laughs> Dear. God forbid I should become predictable. Uh, pasture. God, they're still emptying it. Come on. Everyone, help. Do it and do it now. Uh, right, 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 right. Is there anything else useful I can do? Kiln has snuffed it. Oh yeah. So that was doing that. Yeah, so I need to sort out the caravan stables quite badly. Because there will be all sorts going on there. What's that? Oh, okay. Oh, there's no warehouse. Oh, that's the nearest one. Of course I can't fit a sodding warehouse in there, can I? Like one building block square thing out. Oh, how annoying. Hmm. Anyway. It's done. Uh, is this all done? Can I stick? Yeah, that's done. So I can... 
What's I doing here? Oh yeah, we're finishing the wharf. <laughs> Good lord. Uh, I think I'll put a doobly doll what's it thing of me bob there. To use the technical phrase. Shift, da -de da And when that's emptied, when the pasture's emptied, I shall send them all over here to help out. Which means they're going to help empty the sod in pasture. Yes, they are. That's what we want to do. Let's just pause it quick. And poof, they're off. Feel complete. I did set instructions to build pavements there, didn't I? Yeah. Hmm, thought I did. Did I miss that one? Oh, apparently, I missed that one. Okay. Right. Um, okay. So I'm just going to have a bit of a potter around. I want to get another house in as well. I've got space for 500 residents. Um, only 452 at the moment. They seem to have. Um, <laughs> gone on a bit of a, um, what should we call it, a procreation diet. <laughs> Seem to have gone all deeply religious and or, or abstaining or whatever, I don't know. Um, so I'm gonna gonna stop recording now and sort out the caravan stable trade routes while the villagers finish all this lark off. You do see some odd sights when you take over a villager, just casually walking in her house. feet sticking out the bottom of a donkey. Come on, come out of the house again, that was quite amusing. There we go. Oh, it looks better now. Must have bugged out of it, I suppose. And then you blow the horn, and that coupled with pavement turns people like teenagers into, teenagers into speed moonwalkers. But none are going to come past now I've said that. Good golly. It could even look like a medieval village. I do need to finish the lamppost off there, don't I? So I can uh, just draw a line under that. Go for a little wander. She's got enough food in her belly for the time being. Hello, boys and girls. Very nice to see you. Loads of little horrors. My, my, how the village has grown. Better let go of this village before she starves to death. Some rather nice views turning up. It's a late winter, so I uh, probably haven't got too much longer until um, the year's finished, I would imagine. I didn't notice when it went into late winter because I was too busy demolishing that. Um, pasture was the word, I think, isn't it? Right, let's lay the new one. So we want moo cows. You see, look, you do it that way, and it's, you can, um, get it to fit beautifully between the pavement, lines of the pavement, but if you try and do one, so starting from there, going to, either stops too short, or goes too over. Most inconvenient. Uh, have we got spare people? Yeah, we've got spare people, so... I'll just set some instructions for them to prioritise that, so all the spare bods can give them end. 
and the second pasture for moo cows will be built because at the moment we're not quite producing enough milk I've done quite a lot of um, market trading to keep the levels of milk up hence you know my um, objective of expanding the cows the cow pasture How are we getting on over here so those two new sections are all almost done let's see if I can level this out a bit make it look a bit prettier needs to look a bit prettier than it is uh, was that the place I think that was the place where I couldn't actually fair house <laughs> after all that is oh no imagine then that no good okay we can uh, so do we want a house there guess Um, there. There's shilling tea. And then when they've finished loading the pasture up, which it looks like they have, they can all get on with that house. And that will give me 510 capacity. So we can just ignore the housing situation for a little while. And let the population grow of their own accord. That'd be nice. Yeah, cool. So if my guess is right, I would say this is the last night of the long winter. When the sun rises, a new year, year 56, will dawn upon the villages of Ironhaven. Uh, oh, that was that one. Right, okay. And there we go, there's early spring. So, another year finishes. Where's the sun gone? There it is. Yeah, I keep saying some lovely effects in this game if you just kind of dawdle your way through as I tend to. Every now and again I think, oh, I should probably record some of this. But then, who knows how many people have actually watch it. It's not exactly a, a Call of Duty kind of game or Battlefield or whatever. But, works for me. Um, so yeah, that's it. Brings year 55 to a close. Loads of building done again. Lots of good progress. Reorganised all this nicely. Reorganised all this nicely. Wall over there. More pavementing done over there. And, and um, buildings rebuilt. We got any... Uh, no quarries or whatever have been emptied. Oh yes, there is one. So busy concentrating on other things. But I didn't see that. Anymore? No, that was it. Okay, cool. Yeah, so um, that's <laughs> that's year 55 done. I'll be back soon for year 56. Alright, see you soon. Bye.